Flushy family you know it's your boy Sting T. Too Flushy. And we got. And it's your girl Petra. And we got. Zayn Corn Too Flushy. And Zayla. <laughs> She's excited. Yep, 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 guys. So we're heading on the road. What are we about to do today, baby? Well, we're not really going anywhere. <laughs> but we're going somewhere. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, well, this month is this big head's birthday. Mm -hmm. and, and my other love of my life back birthday. there, her birthday. So their birthday is one day apart. One day apart. One, two, one behind each other. Mm -hmm. One day apart. So I'm starting the preparations for their birthday. And... I had to order some stuff from different party cities because they weren't available online. It wasn't available at one party city. And since I'm doing the preparations from now, I ordered stuff from three different party cities. Wow. <laughs> three? Yeah, three. So we're about to go pick up the, the items that I ordered. Um, you know, with quarantine, quarantine and you know COVID-19 and yeah. the pro protests and all the stuff that's going on in the world it's like you know the stores are still not really welcoming people inside as much and I personally don't feel comfortable going inside anyways because yeah. pe some people don't understand social distancing and they want to be all up on your ass when you're walking around so I'd rather Drive do curbside pickup. <laughs> yeah, I don't, curbside. Even wanna, I don't even want to do in-store pickup. So I have three different stores to go to to do in-store pickup. Y'all put y'all two cents in the comments and let us know. Do y'all go in the stores? Do y'all walk around? What y'all do? What y'all feel comfortable doing? I personally haven't really been anywhere yet. Babe has to go to work every day. So he's in the public every day and I'm still you terrified of that. Gotta get that money though, you know? Stay my six feet and wash my hands and you know use my sanitizers and spray down and everything. But Wear your mask. It's a little scary wearing my mask every day. Yeah. Dealing with people in retail, but there go the popo. <laughs> Popo's right in front of us. You know, a lot of these people, police brutality stuff that's been going on, the people in some of the videos have been very respectful. Of course. And there's this still happening, so I seen an incident where a dude got arrested, hand behind the back and still got thrown to the floor and all that yeah thing. like they're just stop, being man. nasty i don't know i don't understand why the hate why you know why can't we just all be respectful of each other mm. why can't you just put me in a cuff and tell me and talk to me sit me down no, and talk why to do me. they have to put you in a cuff, e cuff no, if it gets to that point I if, mean, you, like, if, if it you, gets to that if point you have a warrant for your arrest or if you're a criminal and they have they know that you are wanted for such for criminal activity mm -hmm. sure put the cuffs on but they're putting people in handcuffs without even knowing why exactly they're putting people in handcuffs you, you know they what it is in, they put them in handcuffs and then tell them later on mm -hmm. oh you know i'm gonna arrest you for being foolish some foolishness that they make up it's and not it has most of the time they arrest like we we have nothing against popos because you know y'all got to do your job we appreciate yeah. the ones that are the doing ones it the right do way their job we appreciate that uh -huh, but it's like if you pull me over and i ask you why you pull me over tell me and then look at my license and let me go you got to initiate something for me to get arrested and then the people that end, end up getting shot for no reason at all. And at the end of the day, it's, it wasn't about the arrest. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. It's crazy, but it's you know, really crazy. we love y'all. You know, just give y'all. Y'all stay safe. Y'all just be safe. Stay prayed up and stay safe because without God, we're nothing. And in this world that we're living in, you need God to guide you every step of the way. Because yes, if you do. don't have Him. You have nothing. You get lost and confused. Right, and and I think that's what these police need is Jesus. <laughs> they need some holy water. The bad ones. They need holy water. Yeah, the ones that the ones that again. don't have no kind of logic or sense or the way they think or handle situations is like they they it's like they 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 treat people like they're not humans. Mm -hmm. They are the ones who are not acting like humans. Exactly, and then they just get off and it's it, we, we 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 all. It's not just black people. We all are tired of the foolishness and just. Popos just do right, man. Just yeah, do your the job. police that's just acting like they're bigger than everybody else. You're mm. y'all are not acting like humans. My dad always told me that you no, know, police officer is just a regular man with a gun that has a law behind no, him. No, so. they're they're not humans at all. There's some there's yeah. some other there's some other kind of thing. The ones who are doing their job and respect their job and respect mm. their title, because your title is just a title. Mm -hmm. Your title doesn't mean shit as far as who you are. Yep, yep, your title yep. is just a title. You're a police officer of the law. You need to live as such and not mm -hmm. just be bringing your strong arm just because you can. And then, you know, what, what, what kind of sick in me sometimes? They're trying to instill fear in people. That's annoying. It's like you're instilling, instilling fear in people, but then again, 
you you arrest someone, you and him probably tuck, tuck, tussle it out a little, and it, every, the situation is calm. You, you you got him in cuff, and then the backup come and just jump on the dude like without asking any questions. Yeah, I've seen too many videos like that. Crazy, too man. Too many. Too many. One eternity later. It's, it's this crazy. Situation. Anyways, we went on a rant about the foolishness for a little bit too long. Not as long as we wanted. Like, this is not what we came out here for, guys. Uh, what <laughs> it does, we just frustrated. That's it. Yeah, it is. We, we it's bet. just, it's just too much. It's too much. I've seen too much. Um, I don't know. So we basically stay home because of that. Yeah. I don't want no problems. <laughs> we don't want no problems, problems, you know. We don't want no problems because you don't have to do anything for them to say something to you. Yeah. You could, you just, you, we, we, we already, the one, we already did something as far as they're concerned. We I have an wrong, idea. We got the wrong color. I have an idea. What's the idea? So Paul, Paul, pull me over and be like, mmm, mmm. Well, you don't know how to speak. They're going to rush you. Mm. <laughs> like, like, mm, mm. I'm not saying nothing to him. No, just just drive straight. You drive like 10 minutes to work, so just... just. I know how to deal with them, but you know, I, I get why some people it's go crazy. Not, it doesn't matter. They're just tired of being them, targeted, babe. you know? A lot of people, like the ones that have died, that have died um, babe, over that, that have died It doesn't matter years. if you know how to deal with them, because they're the ones with the problem. It's not you, it's not the people who are getting har um, harassed that have a problem. It's the people, it's the police officers who are harassing the people. They gotta be checked mentally, man. Some of they're these police the ones, have to be checked mentally. Man. Exactly, they're the ones with the problem because they're the ones who are being aggressive towards the, the, the citizens and then arresting them, making wrongful arrests, killing people and thinking it's okay. And they get off, so guess what? I'm glad these other cops that did so the So far, I'm glad Floyd. that George Floyd, his in a the quarter mile, killed him. Straight, all Georgia four of those police officers have been arrested and charged. I feel like those paramedic looking people, mm -hmm. I don't know if they're really paramedics because I've seen a gun on one of their hips. They didn't even check the guy when they pulled up. They should have pushed that police him. off of him. They like, just pulled him onto the stretcher yeah. lifelessly. Continue so they need to get checked too. Years. Even if they don't get um, charged with murder or manslaughter or whatever the case is because he was Something probably be dead done with before. Them too. Yeah. He was probably dead before they got there. I've never been, a, been to paramedic school and I don't know nothing about paramedics. Georgia 138 <laughs> but as a human being, you come you come at a scene to, to, to do I, your job. I feel like I'm gonna uh. need to see, like I feel like they should have checked to see if he was okay. Mm -hmm. Like They checked his pulse, know that he died and then they backed off and they start doing it like, you know when you come pick up a normal but they, I, they and the tried man to, still they had his foot on his neck. They should have tried to resuscitate him. Mm. They didn't try to do anything. And I'm, that's I'm, I need to get out of the subject because this is just yeah. going to get me emotional. Right We're, we just want to go pick up my the, my baby's party supplies. Hopefully yeah. we can get there safely and back home. They don't know what's planning, what's being planned. We I'm just we picking up know. stuff. Isaiah, so. we don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> She's not even looking. Sayla! Mm -hmm. She's not even What's she playing with her water bottle? Hey. Zoe, what up? Hot your flashy family. <laughs> yeah, what you gotta say, baby? Say, say something. Let's lighten the mood. Yeah. Yeah, hey, what you gotta say? Daddy, I wanna play a game with me and you played before. What game is that? So, um, any car that we want, any color car we want to pick, um, we play too flashy when we see that color. Yeah, we're gonna be on the road for a long time, so yeah, we could do that. <laughs> no, for real. We're gonna be on the road, like, we're gonna be, we're driving to three different party cities. Daddy. In three different cities. Yeah. I pick, um, gray. Gray? Yeah. You gotta pick another color, because gray and white sometimes on the road look alike. So pick a brighter color, baby. Or just the color that's obvious? Brown. Brown? brown. Yeah. You definitely yeah, see brown. You ain't gonna find no brown red. car. Mm? Okay, red. She said red. Red? Nice. Any shade of red for her. For both of us? For everybody? No. Yeah. Am I going the right way? Yeah. I think you are. So I'm gonna find a red car. Look, Zoe. Zoe. Zoe, they go red one. They go a red car. Too flashy. Hey. Too flashy. Too flashy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You found that red one, Zoe? Yeah, let's let's try to find some more. Alright? There goes a couple over there, Zoe. Red cars. Too flashy. Too flashy. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta look in the people's yards. <laughs> it has three because we saw two red cars over there. there was, yeah, there's three, yeah. Look at you doing math, baby girl. You count them too. Yeah, let's see if we can find a couple more. Maybe up on a front. Yep. Shall we? Yeah. 
that one off road to drive. I didn't want to do all this driving by myself. Like, this would have been, like, Zoe, I think we gonna get some more red cars around here. Yeah, There's one over there, Zoe. Over by the gas station, parked up two of them. Right there, Zoe. What? By right the there, by the gas station. You're gonna see them. Oh, I see, I see it. Two flashing. Two flashing. Yeah, it's two of them. There they go. Two, two red. Two flashing again. Yep. So that was four. Five. No four. Oh yeah, It's five. two, because we have that three. There go two more coming down the road. Two flashing, two flashing. He spot them. He spot them from afar. <laughs> Camera didn't even reach them yet. Yeah, there they go right here. Too flashy. Too flashy. <laughs> uh, so we had a fun game. Too flashy. See hey. another one. <laughs> <laughs> Not caught it. Caught it. Too flashy. <laughs> too late. <laughs> too flashy. Too late. Too flashy. Too late. Yes, everyone. So make sure you guys. Uh, go and subscribe to the channel if you're not already a member. Hit that subscribe button. It's right there. Look, mm -hmm. look right down there, right down, there, down, down there. there. Hit it. <laughs> Hit subscribe. Mm -hmm. Turn notifications on so you don't miss a new video when we post one. Mm -hmm. Give us a huge thumbs up. We love when you guys like the videos. Uh -huh. Give us your two cents you know, in the comments. Let us know what you guys think about the video. Or what Share else it you with your friends, your family. Mm -hmm. Too flashy. Found another red car. Too, Too flashy. flashy. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. So go do that, girls. Oh, too flashy! Have you found that all up in the bush? <laughs> go too flashy! Well, oh, this camera about to fall over, man. <laughs> that got me twisting and turning. Oh my gosh. Oh my yeah. gosh. Why is my GPS not going the right direction? So guys, we just pulled up. I uh -huh. called him twice already. I don't know exactly where curbside pickup is, <laughs> but I called him twice already. They didn't answer, so I'm about to go inside myself and get the one package that I have. This one is a small order. So guys, me and T are actually planning. I hope y'all can hear me. We planned a prank on Zoe. I just picked up her straight out of preschool plaque. And we're gonna tell her that she is not gonna go to kindergarten. She's gonna be so heartbroken when we tell her that because she actually is she's actually looking forward to go to kindergarten. So we're gonna catch her right now in the car with her that she's not gonna go to kindergarten and see how she reacts to that. We've been vlogging on the way, so she's not gonna expect anything. She's just gonna think that oh we're just vlogging. I'm gonna tell her that I got an email and she's not gonna go to kindergarten. She has to go to pre K, she has to go back to pre K and see how she responds. Oh, too flashy again, too flashy. All right. We're about to go get some food, guys. Yeah, food time. Zoe says she wants Taco Bell, so we all gonna get Taco Bell. Put your seatbelt on, baby. You want Taco Bell, baby? Yeah, We're about to go get some Taco Bell. Put some food in our belly and then we're gonna go to the second store and we actually on the time crunch right now i didn't realize it was this late yeah. and the store is actually closed pretty early today so we gotta hurry up hopefully the line of taco bell is not too long so we can get service quickly and mm -hmm. on our way i could probably cut some time down in traffic by cutting time down you know what i mean all right full time yeah babe while i was in the store i got an email from zoe's teacher zoe your teacher emailed me and told me that um, you have to do pre-K again. You're not going to be able to go to, pre to kindergarten next year. What? Really? Yeah, yeah you're not going to be able to go to kindergarten next year, Zoe. So you're going to have to go back to pre-K. So she's not having a graduation anymore? She's, she's, she didn't have a graduation. What? Yeah. So because of coronavirus, you have to go back to Daddy, kindergarten, Zoe. Daddy, I mean pre-K, yeah. Oh. Well, that's good because I miss pre-K. Oh. And I want to go to kindergarten too. I yeah, but you're not gonna go to kindergarten because you have to do pre-K over. You can't do both at the same time. Yeah. Oh, that's crazy. Why would they do that? And I, and Zoe was so excited about kindergarten. You're still excited about kindergarten? Yeah. Oh. So that means her friend's gonna go and she's not going. Yeah. Wow. Your friends, you're not gonna, your friends are not gonna be there anymore because they're gonna go to kindergarten. Uh -oh. Uh, 
You know what's up, girl? Look <laughs> Wow. Zilla said, uh oh. Zilla said, uh oh, like she knows. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is Zilla going to go to the bus and pick at me? No. I mean, is she going to go to. Um, baby pre-K. Daycare while you go to pre-K? No, they said you're going to have to go into a special program. By yourself. Yeah. You okay? Yeah. What's wrong? Cheer up, baby. Don't worry. You gotta work harder next time. You'll okay? go. Yeah, next time when you next time you'll go. If you pass all your tests in school, or you know, all if you participate in class and all that stuff, and you go to the center. What they call it? Center time? Circle time? Mm -hmm. No, center time. Center time. And you yeah, go to center time. Yeah, center means like a playing time. Oh. Okay. Mm. I don't know what to say. And we don't have I wish you were going to kindergarten. I'm going to see you in your uniform. You sad, mommy? I am. I'm sad too. You sad, Zayla? And the next reason why I'm sad is because I want to be Well, your birthday's still going to come. You're just going to be in pre-K, not kindergarten. Wow. What really happened? Like, why did they do that? Mm -hmm. You know why they did that zone? No. You, you didn't work hard enough? I did. Yeah, because I saw you work and put and do it do your grades and stuff. And I thought you did good too. Yeah, you did good grades. Zoe. Cheer up, baby. You sad? Oh. Poor baby. Where's Papa Bell? Things gonna get better, okay baby? Daddy and mommy loves you, okay? A few moments later. You know what you said? How did Miss Angie know I was going to kindergarten? How she know you was going to kindergarten? Yeah. Because remember you were in you were in the Well you'll be fine, baby. You just gotta work harder, okay? I Amen? was working hard. I was working hard, but we just gotta go back to kindergarten. What's this girl doing? What's the other doing? Taking Why out the thing and the putting it in her hand. Leave the straw alone. So we're here at the second party city and it's actually going the way it's supposed to go. So the first party city, something was wrong with their phone. Mm -hmm. Whatever. They went inside, got the stuff, and came out. And now I'm at the second party city and they're on their way out. See, the trunk is open already, waiting for them to come and put the items in. That's how it was supposed to work the first time. Like, what's up with that? Anywho, technical difficulties. Zoe, how you feeling? Sad. Still sad? Yes. Why are you sad? Because I miss. I want. I was so excited to go to kindergarten. Uh -uh. Well, guess what? what? We're gonna practice more reading, and then guess what's gonna happen? What? You're gonna go to kindergarten. Yeah! Because it was a prank. Move, move you. your head, move your head. It was a prank. Ah, uh, we got her. That's funny. <laughs> got you. <laughs> got you. You know I still miss pre-K? I know you miss pre-K. We got her. Hi. Yes. Mm -hmm. You can put it in the trunk. Right, Thank you. Got her real good. Yeah. <laughs> and it was too, right? Yes, too yeah. Right. Okay, thank you. Thank you. And Zoe, you got pranked. It's not funny. <laughs> it is funny. Zayla, laugh at her, Zayla. So about your family, look at my hair. Ooh, I like your hair, baby. I did, my mom did pranks. Ooh. Okay. Something like that. Let's see what's on the Morrow Store clothes. So guys, yeah, we had to drive all over the place and we got a late start to this driving all over the place stuff. <laughs> the third store is closed, so we're not gonna go today, but we pranked Zoe. Ooh, <laughs> she got pranked. Yes. Yes. We did. Talking about she's sad. <laughs> Be quiet. No, but she really was sad. Mm -hmm. So, guys, make sure y'all put y'all two cents in the comments. Tell us what you think about this prank on Zoe. Mm -hmm. You know, we're party planning. We're you guys store never, hopping. You guys never 
Zayla. She's Zayla's too small. <laughs> Once she gets older, you guys should shut the Yeah, she's gonna get it too. She's over here cleaning the mess that she made with her juice from Taco Bell. But thank y'all so much for watching this video. We really appreciate y'all being here. We love y'all for all the love and support we got from y'all so far. I have something to share to them. What you wanna share, baby? Make sure you um give a huge thumbs up and click the subscribe button. Yep, yep, yep. And yep. share with your friends, anyone you know. And I said, we love y'all. And guess what, guys? We all say, Too Fleshy!